It's maths! It's maths! Let's rub the magic elbow patch and see what fun is coming up today. No more sad maths. It's bad maths time. Pay attention, it's Maths Mansion, the game show where you get to test your maths ability. Feel the tension in Maths Mansion. Let's see how good at learning maths these kids are gonna be. If they want out, then they must earn it. There's no leaving till they learn it. The only way of getting out is mathematically. <laughs> yes. Locked up inside Maths Mansion are six kids who will never escape. Until they have learnt their maths. No leaving without learning. And what are two of the team being tested on today? Dividing by ten. Oh no. It's that terrible program breaking through again. Stop watching. Stop watching before it's too late. Now it's time to divide by ten. Will you help me, Great Big Hen? <laughs> Not that Great Big Hen again. We don't want that sort of stuff interfering with this programme. Right, who's ready with their maths, Mouse? I'm Hannah Edwards from Croydon. I'm Rylan Thompson from Epsom. Like it in Epsom, do you? It's all right. Cos you're not going to see Epsom again until you've learnt your maths. Right. OK. 6,420. You've got to divide that number by ten, just by moving the digits to the right. Still looks like 6,420 to me. And now it says, well, still 6,420. You really like that number, don't you? I moved the digits to the right. But you're missing something. Brains, for a start. Look, there it is. What are you pointing at? I'm not pointing. I'm decimal pointing. That's what you need, a decimal point. The important little dot that separates the units from the tenths. OK, Hannah Edwards, I'm giving you the decimal point. And you've got to put it where it should go. OK, let's see if you can divide 5,000 by 10, just by moving the digits to the right. Moving the digits to the right. One zero going the other side of the decimal point. Moving the other digits to the right. 5,000 becomes 500.0. 500. 500. 500. Oh, All thanks to the decimal point. Oh, no. Not again. Move the digits to the right. La, 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 la. Move the digits to the right. La, 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 la. Move the digits to the right. La, 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 la. Forget it, sad man. You'll never do it without the decimal point. We think it's rude to point, don't we? Hmm. So, I don't have a decimal point. I have a little green decimal P instead. <laughs> and if we put the decimal P next to the eggy zero and move the digits to the right, move the digits to the right, la 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 la, move the digits to the right, we've divided 400 by 10. It's 40. And we didn't have to point. We had a P instead. All around you, are the maths monsters doing the maths jobs that have to be done. And this week, look out for the divider. It's dividing 8,000. In goes the decimal point. Moving the digits to the right. 8,000 divided by 10, 800. 800 divided by 10, 80. 80 divided by 10, 
Eight. Watch those digits moving right. Move the digits one place to the right. When you've done it, you've divided by ten. Move the digits one place to the right. When you've done it, you've divided by ten. Again. Again. Move the digits one place to the right. When you've done it, you've divided by ten. Again. Again. Turn the hundreds into tens and the tens into units. The units into tens move along the row, along the row. Move the digits, move the digits. One place to the right for dividing, for dividing. Right is the way to go. Right is the way to go. The way to go. The way to go. The way to go. Good afternoon to you, sir. What bus number are you waiting for? Uh, either a 207 or an 83. An 83? Oh, no, sir, you have not heard the news. Apparently, all bus numbers have been divided by 10. So that's an 8.3. An 8.3 is right. Would you mind showing everyone just how you reached <laughs> that number? We have an 8 and a 3. Hold up, 83. Now, to divide by 10, you move the digits to the right. Wow. Look how we did that so carefully and smoothly. 8.3 is absolutely right. Good man. You are. Thank you. Oh, and here comes your bus. <laughs> so, are you ready to divide by 10? Yes. Well, what a shame, because this time you've got to divide by 100. That's not fair. Don't get mad. Get maths. So, if you're ready for the test, the test. He's ready for you. Right, have a look at this number. 2,525. Divide it by 100, just by moving the digits to the right. Wait, we need a decimal point. You want one, you shall have one. Grab the decimal point. Better get moving those digits. They're moving the digits. Moved one place to the right. 252.5. They've divided by 10 so far. Move them again. And the digits are moving right again. They've divided by 10. And 10 again. 25.25. The gong's bonged. Did they do it? Yes! Yes, I suppose so. They moved the digits to the right two places to divide by 100, which means you get this week's maths card. But remember, you're going to need a lot more if you're to leave Maths Mansion. Another test another time. Until then, no leaving without learning. Maths. You've seen them do it. How do you think you'd do? Take a look at this. Divide this number, 654,321, by 10, 100 and 1,000. By moving those digits. And remember... Pay attention, it's Maths Mansion The game show where you get to test your maths ability Feel the tension in Maths Mansion Let's see how good at learning maths these kids are gonna be If they want out, then they must earn it There's no leaving till they learn it The only way of getting out is mathematically <laughs> Have you eaten my decimal P? Have you? Have you? <laughs>